what is going on good morning <laughs> so all right it's not as early as i normally do things um i woke up a little bit later this morning than i typically do mainly because i was up much later than normal um one i started walk watching a documentary on uh gaming uh it was a uh, role-playing games, RPGs, uh, Dungeons and Dragons was the big focus on it, and it was actually kind of interesting, it was almost a little painful to watch, because, I mean, you can see that some of these folks, they've let their life revolve around that gaming so much that it's impacting their jobs. It's impacting their families and friendships. And I'm all for love something, man. Have a passion. But, man, once it starts to impact your finances, once it starts to impact your, your family in a negative way, then maybe you need to, to relook at that passion a little bit. Amy, I don't know. I mean, I, I don't know. I mean, it's some of the things that I have a passion about. Hey, what happened? This is real life. Oh, I talked too much. I did too much stuff before this. Anyway, um, man, I almost went like total Yoda on you. Now you shall go now, Pastor. <laughs> Tim the Tool Man Taylor. <laughs> All right. Folks, I haven't had any coffee yet, and I got the cat in the background sitting there going to the bathroom, which it is, luckily I think it's pee, so it's it doesn't stink, which is, you know, okay, I guess? Anyway, so this week is going to be an interesting week, uh, last day at the current job, a couple days off, starting the new job, um... And I feel really good. I'm a little nervous about it, but I feel really good, which is uh, which is a good thing. Um, let's see what else. I really didn't think this through, did I? I thought about it yesterday, though. I did think about it yesterday, about the fact that I felt absolutely empowered. I felt untouchable. And I don't mean that I, I suddenly was going to go walking around the office and be an absolute dick to people or anything like that. What... What it really did for me in my mind was to um, is to realize that all the things that had been kind of stressing me out, all the things that had been uh, bothering me, I, I didn't have that anymore. I didn't worry about it, you know? And it's weird because all of a sudden, my work went faster. I ended up doing better because I didn't have the stress on me. I didn't have the worry that any second now some bullshit lie was going to be said about me that was going to have my agency calling and saying, we need to have a talk. Wow. So you know what? That does say a lot. It says a lot. Whenever you have a couple of people that are just such cancers that they can have that type of a negative impact, how that does impact the performance of everyone else, how it, how it changes that dynamic. So, interesting. Interesting. Uh, man, this weekend, big weekend for me. Um, finishing up the office. Uh, I've got to get everything cleaned up again. Uh, moving a bookshelf that I traded for a six-pack of root beer in Texas. That's just how we do it, folks. We trade furniture for beverages. And apparently, this was apparently a, a deal and a half that I couldn't I couldn't drop. Um, ironically, I also traded another six-pack of root beer to the same gentleman for a new garbage disposal. <laughs> So, um, yeah, so uh, eventually I will get that fixed and taken care of. I'm just not looking forward to getting on the ground. Um, just my knees are already jacked up and getting down 
and up off the ground is going to suck. That's okay. We'll handle that whenever we got to handle that. Uh, what else is going on? Easter. We got Easter tomorrow. Happy Easter. For those of you that, that enjoy the Easter, enjoy it. Enjoy the idea that we have the Easter bunny, not an Easter chicken, which would be more feasible. Easter chicken would actually lay an egg. Easter bunny, you know, they would just leave you bunny nuggets everywhere. And those are not edible. That's, that's just all I'm going to say. Bunny nuggets, not edible. Um, it makes me think, too. Lucky Rabbit's feet. I remember when that was a big thing at one point. And I always asked myself, what if it was so lucky for the rabbit, why'd he lose his foot? That just didn't make sense to me. So, you know, I don't even know. Do they even do rabbit's feet anymore? I, I just don't see people walking around with them. You know, they're like, rabbit, 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 rabbit. All right. So I've talked long enough, guys. Um, I'm going to try to get a little deeper tomorrow <laughs> uh, in my video. But the big one's actually going to come on either Tuesday or Wednesday. Um, where I'm going to kind of talk about my last day at my current job. And that's going to be the, it's going to be the big one. Because I'm going to kind of really go into my thoughts and feelings about the last, last year and, and, and few months. So you guys take care, live life loudly, be good to yourself, be good to others. Bye.